Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Thank you very much for joining me. My name is Michelle Klungu and I do videos about online shopping. So if you're interested in this kind of uh, uh, content, you are at the right place. So in today's video, I'm going to share with you some of uh, uh, one of the most controversial topic in my group and uh, the one that uh, cut, catches almost everyone's attention when it's brought up. And uh, this has to do with uh, WeChat. So um, if you're in my group, you are familiar with the WeChat platform. Uh, so in today's video, I'm going to explain to you uh, some of uh, the what WeChat is and uh, what's it, uh, what it's, it's used for. And then I'll also explain uh, the some of the advantages of uh, having WeChat and some of the uh, disadvantages. And uh, yeah, so... Um, yeah, so I'll not waste much of your time and uh, I'll begin now. So uh, when you say WeChat, uh, actually uh, WeChat is a social media platform and uh, it's a, a, a platform where uh, you use just like a WhatsApp and uh, the one for WeChat is a kind of a more advanced and uh, it's mainly used by uh, people in China. So that's why you find that uh, those who are into business of uh, importing and exporting, which are, should be a familiar uh, uh, platform that you should be on to. And uh, so in my group, people want to be on WeChat. It's very easy. You can find it on uh, Play Store or Google um, Apple Store. It's available and it's free to, da to download. And you can uh, actually register with your phone number. It's very easy. Although the um, the registration process needs another person who's already on WeChat so that they can scan you and then you become part of uh, the uh, WeChat. Otherwise, uh, sometimes uh, you are also limited to how many scans you can do. So make sure that you do not over scan. And uh, uh, I think I also throw in some of the disadvantage when you're just registering. So do not uh, start, uh, for example, adding people uh, like la on a lapid, sending requests to people, it, you will be uh, blocked. So to avoid that, just keep on uh, wait a little bit, use it a little bit, be familiar with it, and then build on slowly from there yeah so that's uh, basically what wechat is about is a social media platform where you chat with people and uh, you get to socialize that's the like the uh, the basic information about uh, wechat now what can it be used for so that's the main uh, issue here so wechat can be used to talk to suppliers direct to uh, in china so when you are on WeChat, you can have contacts for suppliers in China because, as you all know, uh, WhatsApp is limited in China. Like mainland China, you cannot access WhatsApp, but uh, WeChat is available. So for the outside world to communicate with people in, in China, you need uh, WeChat. So that WeChat is the one that you will use to talk to direct, uh, directly to the suppliers in China. Yeah, so that's how it's used. And uh, I'll now throw in some of the advantages of having uh, WeChat and uh, WeChat contacts. So when you have WeChat, um, one of the advantages is, I explained you have direct contact with suppliers. So you can have direct supply, uh, contact with um, factory suppliers, so you can have good only discounted uh, price. So, uh, for example, like using Alibaba, because you're using Alibaba as a platform to reach to, so the supplier is using Alibaba to reach to its audience. So there is a middleman there, which is uh, Alibaba, and uh, there are fees to be paid and all that. So it uh, adds on to the cost of the item that you are buying. But when it comes to WeChat, you are talking direct to the supplier, so it means there is no any middleman in between. So it means prices will be relatively cheaper than buying from Alibaba. So you are talking direct to suppliers. So that's a, one of the biggest advantages that you can have when you're using your WeChat. And uh, apart from that, you can also negotiate very uh, smoothly. 
and then you can also do um, uh, customization of the packaging in terms of uh, because you you are not uh, you are not uh, grounded by the loss of the platform. So there, there are no uh, business uh, grounds for WeChat. You are just talking as a as someone you know. So it's very uh, easy to use. Uh, that's this uh, the, the the advantage, and uh, the disadvantage is that. Uh, WeChat is not designed to be a uh, trading platform. So uh, there is no security in terms of uh, money. There is no security in terms of how you transfer money and if it can be held up by someone or those kind of things. It's not uh, meant for that. And then it does not have a shipping uh, um, platform like uh, where you can track your item and other things. So it's uh, just you and the supplier and in between you there is trust that's all there is and then after that you are also at risk of flood or scam because the platform itself it's not designed to uh to for e-commerce so it means it's also prone to scams scammers are everywhere so you have to be very particular when you're dealing on a uh, wechat which uh, also brings me to this point you should always use the uh, the, the the suppliers which are recommended to you by someone who has used them and who has um, um, was proof over them not being scammers but actually being the, the the actual sellers or in other instances because not everything is a uh, uh, you can also check how they deal with other people check their moment or uh, yeah check their moment check their um, uh, how they, they post their products, you can see if they are professional or they're just scammers. When some prices are too good to be true, you are actually at a high risk of uh, bumping into a, uh, a scammer. So you have to be relatively very particular with pricing and all that. And the communication should be there. Make sure that when you're chatting, you are communicating and you are asking the right questions. Otherwise, you will be uh, disappointed at the end of it when you are not very particular with your questions. So uh, apart from that, so this is basically what WeChat is all about. And uh, I will also talk about how you you buy. So there is what we call moments on a, on a WeChat. So the supplier will be posting things on there. And then when you see them, you can inbox them the picture and ask about a certain pro uh, product and then they can uh, share with you more information. The other thing is you can uh, just go direct to them and uh, ask for information. So that's another way you can do it. And after that, make sure that uh, you, uh, um, you, are, you, you, you request for very, um, cost, like I can say, very uh, specific uh, um, requests. So don't be vague don't just say i want a phone uh, let's say you want to buy a phone don't just don't just say i want a phone make sure you describe the phone you want it to be this color you want it to be the, this uh, how many gb it should be this and that make sure that you specify all the things that you need otherwise you will get something that you were not expecting so make sure that you have that kind of skill to talk to a supplier and get a good deal out of it yeah so uh, that's about uh, the, the entire um, um, like process of buying and then the process of paying so before I say about paying I'll say about shipping so shipping is relatively uh, simple because you have to just uh, send a um, your your fly cargo in this instant your fly cargo shipping address to your supplier and then the supplier will send the item to fly cargo it's very simple Payment, you need an agent that you cannot uh, bypass unless you say you have, you live in China or you have a, uh, a person, someone in China with a bank in mainland China who has access to funds. They can pay on your behalf, yeah. But if you live in Zambia or some part of Africa, you need someone to pay on your behalf, those who have uh, uh, contacts with people in China. So 
you will communicate with them and then they will share with you all the information. So that's how it's done. And uh, they will pay on your behalf, then you send them the money, then the, the buyer receives the, the, uh, the funds, then they send the items to you. So it's that simple. Yeah, so make sure that you find also reliable um, um, agents to pay. Yeah, so that's about payment, and uh, the rest is history. Uh, if you want to know more, you can, you're always welcome to join one of my online classes. I have one-on-one uh, -on -one classes. I no longer do uh, group classes. I focus on an individual for various reasons, and uh, my number will be on the screen if you want to communicate with me, and uh, you can also join the WhatsApp group to learn more. Otherwise, I really enjoy your support. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, like this video and share to your friends and uh, thank you very much see you in my next video bye bye peace